Hey guys, how you doing? This is a quick tutorial on how to uh, focus on how to do the table of contents. Uh, this is a bit trickier, but uh, it's not too bad. So I have here an open office, and what you do is uh, if you want to create a table of contents for your book, uh, so what you do is let's say you type in table of contents. Um, and then you hit insert and then go down to indexes and tables and then go to indexes and tables so then that should be fine uh, just hit OK and then it came, comes out like that um, but what I do is I don't like this right there so I just make my own uh, so just right click and then edit paragraph style oh sorry right click and uh, edit index table so I get rid of this uh, title right there see and just delete that hit OK so it looks a little bit better and then uh, let's make this a little bit bigger Let's italicize that. Okay. So now uh, the table of contents will help you to know uh, where the pages are. So what you do is let's say uh, let's make a few chapters. Let's go to page break. Let's create a new page and let's go to a few make a few chapters. Let's say, for instance, uh, I want to do chapter one, like that, and uh, let's make it so that uh, chapter one, how to I don't know how to create a book. So here chapter one. So I will highlight this and go into default and then go to heading one. Okay. And then we we'll go back to the table of contents and now right click. And then I'll hit update index table. See, so then how to create a book chapter one and then there's a page number page two so this is page two um, I have to create uh, let's say a footer to show my page number so just go to fields and then page number okay so on page two that's where chapter one is that's where chapter one begins so that's how you do that and every time you want to create for the table of contents you have to put it under heading one okay. let's say if you want to make other uh, chapters or other headings in that particular chapter let's say for instance if I do want to want to do step one um, so I'll just highlight that and then just go to heading two and then I have to update it in the table of contents so just go right click in this area and then hit update and so I, you can see the smaller heading uh, step one okay so that's how you do table of contents in open office